Hello, I'm Anthony Hudson, and I'm so glad you could join us for today's match, which has all the makings of an epic encounter between Richmond and Geelong. Bright sunshine here in Melbourne. It's a pleasure to welcome Gary Lyon. Great to be here, Hutto. Can't wait for the start of this one. Today we have Richmond coming up against Geelong. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. We play the game as it should be played. It's a big midfield battle today. Whichever team can get on top in the middle of the ground will walk out with us today. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp. And the crowd are appreciating it. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. The captains make their way to the middle for the toss. Richmond wins the toss. Players head to their positions as we prepare for the opening bounce. And here we go. It's Richmond taking on Geelong. Garner soccer's the kick. Picked up by Clark. Lobs the handball. McDonald quickly onto the boot. A mighty effort from there, and it's a goal. Gets her first, celebrating hard. And we have the first goal of the match. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. We're back in the middle to resume play. Garner won it down. McDonald slams it onto the boot. Van der Heuvel dropped what she should have taken. Releases by hand. Sends it clear of the contest. Didn't disguise that well enough. And it's been called deliberate. Drives the kick hard. Butler marks. Puts boot to ball. The mark has been taken. Monaghan gets a quick kick away. The umpire pays the free for deliberate. Taylor, urged on by the crowd, prepares the kick. 50 metres out. She drives it towards goal. Hook the kick wide and a behind. The Cats with the edge right now over. The Tigers deciding where to go with the kick in. The kick for Ross. And the mark will be paid. Uses it by foot. Good mark there. Gets a touch to the ball. Off the deck. McDonald soccers it forward. Ross won herself a free. Drives the ball out of defence. Finds a target. McMahon moves it now. Couldn't complete the mark. Just threw the ball. Puts it on the boot. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Goes with the kick. Monaghan wins it back. Monaghan will be the recipient of the free. Elects to kick. Great grab. Campbell goes with the kick. Great mark out the pressure. Goes by hand. Has it now. Going for goal number one. Doing well with the mark. McWilliams elects to kick. Good mark by Hickey. Chose to kick it. 
Gets into a good position to take that. She's got the football now. Drives it out of the pack. Missed the target. Gets the loose ball. Going for goal number one. Richmond fans getting excited about that one. Friedrich celebrating hard. Richmond from the scoreboard now. Garner thumped it clear. Ball up in the center square. What can you tell us, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Ball up call. Tap came from Garner. McMahon dug it out. Darby hunting with authority. Big tackle. Nice hands. Kicks it long. Webster was surrounded. She needed to mark that, and she did. Strong mark in the contest. Decides to kick. Bit of a harsh call, but the umpire saw it as deliberate. Looks up with a kick. Nice mark under pressure. Winds up and goes long. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Slams it on the boot. Does well to cut off the kick. Brennan kicks it. Bander Hubel got up, but couldn't bring it down. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Stabs at the kick. Monaghan gets in a good position. A solid mark from Friedrich. With a driving kick. She takes the mark. One quarter down and three to go. Plenty of football still to be played. The score's Geelong, seven, Richmond, six. Geelong should be happy with their lead, Hutto. They came out focused and committed to a very good game plan. Gary, does anything stand out in the stats? Richmond need to find the ball more. If they can get their hands on the ball, then they can start to create some chances. Thanks for that, Gaz. Ready to go for the second turn. Back with another set of bounce. Hammers it, takes possession. Is in her possession. Releases the handball. She gains the possession. They can link up now. She blasts it through for another. Friedrich with a second goal. Her teammates rush over. Richmond could kick back-to-back -back goals. They've taken the lead. That's a really good team goal. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. Richmond are getting plenty of marks with loose players. They're really able to control the game and move at their own pace. She gets her hands on the footy. The umpire calls for a stoppage. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Receives the handball and takes off. Cranston puts it on the boot. Picked up now. Campbell rushes with the kick, ends up marking uncontested. Moves it by foot, over the top of the pack. Goes by foot. Hickey gets on the end of this. Moves the ball by foot. The ball ends up going to ground. Rushes with the kick. Kicks hurriedly. Takes a strong mark. Chips it towards half forward. They chase after the loose ball. Dishes it off to a player on the run. Clark takes a strong mark. Looks to move it by foot. Gets into some space to mark this. Puts boot to ball. Oh, did you see that? Links with hands. Hickey unable to hold on. Doing well to intercept that kick. Gets it away. At full stride, receives the handball. A lot of possessions for her. Garner on the ground. That certainly didn't look great. It looks unlikely she'll see any further action. 
finds the loose ball. She likes her chances from here. Makes the most of that kick. It's a goal. Pretty happy with that one. It's on again as Geelong take back the lead. Back in the middle now. Boy, got a fist to it. She's got the footy in her hands. Gives the old, don't argue. Marked by Taylor. 50 metres out. Uses it by foot. Marks that ball uncontested. 40 metres from home. Boy, going for number one. What a sensational goal. Smiles all round. Now they lead by seven. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Geelong are winning plenty of the ball at the moment and it's allowing them to create plenty of scoring opportunities. What a tackle! Great tackling there, Hutto. The tackle over the shoulder keeps the kick low. A poorly executed tackle there. Slams it on the boot. Good mark and looks to send it back. Puts it on the boot. She gives chase to the footy, uses the hands and gives away the free. Elects to kick. Takes the mark all by herself. McDonald over the top. Geelong are allowing too many marks inside the opposition for 50. They continue to get beaten in this area. They'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Fans crossing their fingers, hoping she can put this one through the big sticks. <laughs> Going for goal number one. And she's missed. Geelong by eight points. Geelong have been poor with their ball use. They've turned it over on too many occasions and it's allowing the opposition chances to score. Drops the ball, manufactures the handball, tries to release the pressure. We'll get a ball up. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of football. Picks up the loose ball. Wasting a lot of effort there. Ivy slick with the hands. Just gets it onto the boot. The siren sounds and that's the end of the term. The score, Geelong 20 to Richmond 12. Geelong have had a solid first half and will look to show more of the same in the second. Time to take a look at the stats. Geelong getting plenty of possessions at the moment. Thank you, Gaz. With so much on the line, I'm looking forward to this second half. The third quarter about to get underway. Garner with a big fist on it. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Thumps it clear. Great control there. Garner having some trouble down there. Difficult to see her coming back on after that. The Cats beginning to apply their supremacy on the scoreboard with a lead of 21 to 12. Gathers it now. Campbell got the hands free. Needs a bit of a rest. Takes the mark. Friedrich uses it by foot. Terrific mark there. 50 metres out. She likes her chances from here. Oh, what a goal! Get some reward for her efforts. Richmond now only trailed by three. This is how they can score, Big Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. Richmond need to be more efficient with their ball use. They've allowed the opposition too much influence from intercept marks. And now Boyd. Ball up in the centre square. The game is tightened right up. Punches it clear. Gets a quick kick away. Now we've got a ball up. 
boy. Clears the contest. She couldn't get the hand pass away, so she just threw it. Got boot to ball. It's a foot race to get this one. The umpire pays the free kick. Chose to kick it. A good mark under the circumstances. Cranston with the opportunity in front of goal. 45 metres out. She takes aim. A great goal. She sinks her first goal. She loved that one. Geelong for nine. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. It's great to watch her have plenty of excitement. Geelong have managed to rack up a big number of marks, and it's easy to see why they're leading this match. Fantastic tackle. Intercepted. Taken by Brennan. Ends up turning this ball over. Kicks to the square. Right. Not getting much of it, Gaz. Yeah, she's having a quiet match. Hello. Moves the ball by foot. She's leading the ranking points. She's dominating this game. Collects the loose ball. Fumbles the ball. Snaffled up by Ivy. Wood picks it up. Just put it on the boot. A big contested grab. Converting these opportunities could make a big difference to today's result. She heads for home. They are happy with that effort. Three goals so far. Great stuff. Friedrich getting the crowd involved. Richmond behind by three. Thrashes it. Mops up the loose ball. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Oh, it's tense out there at the moment, Hutto. Hands that ball to the opposition. Garrick throws the ball away. Looks to move it by foot. Off hands from Campbell. Just sends it into space. The ball mopped up. It'll be a free kick. Decides to kick. Nice mark under pressure. The kick from Whitford. Picking it up was Kirk. She just can't get out of the action. Wins the race to the ball. They could take the lead here. Drop punt. Finds its way home from Bernardi. That's her first. Celebrating hard. Richmond back in front. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. She did really well there and gets the reward. Richmond have turned the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. Bernardi flew high but didn't hold on. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She hasn't had the impact we were expecting. She drives it towards goal. Congratulated by her teammates. That's three in a row for Richmond. Nine points the difference. She can take off after that handball. Garner bangs it on the boot now. Webster looks to build some momentum with this kick. Takes it well. Moved on by Butler. She finds herself in space and marks. A spearing kick. Intercepts the ball well. Goes with the kick. Takes that one strongly. Might be too far out to score. Skip Geelong trailing by nine. Richmond walk into three-quarter time with the lead and the confidence they can win this game. What do you make of it all, Gaz? Geelong are actually on top in the contested possessions. They just need to convert that dominance into scoreboard pressure. Thanks, Gaz.
One quarter of footy to go. Oh, they've got to take some risks now. They can't afford to waste any time. McMahon receives the ball. Taylor with an easy mark. She decides to go for home. It always looked close, but hits the post. Geelong, close the gap to eight. Richmond have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. That's why they're still in front. The Cats would love to make the most of this opportunity. 45 metres out. Going for goal number one. Goes through from behind. Just two goals in it. Looking to bring it back into play. Uses it now. Van der Heuvel wins the foot race. Sweeping handball. Has it now. She has the ball. With the ball now. She has the ball. McMahon rides out the tackle. Rushes it through for a behind. Ross players move as they look to provide an option. Has it now. Slams it onto the boot. A good mark under the circumstances. Winning the ball in the air was Brennan. Sinks the slipper into it. Off hands. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She needs to find a way into this game. Quickly onto the boot. Taking a nice grab. Looks up with the kick. Coughed up by McDonald. Hacking it out of there. Easily takes the mark. Van der Heuvel drives the kick. Marks now and can send it back. With a driving kick. Spills the mark. Hurried kick. Whitford picks up the loose ball. Receives the handball and takes off. She just throws that ball. Brown kicks it to the square. The loose ball picked up. O'Connor dug out the loose ball. Ivy wins the marking contest. Moves it by foot. Kirk has a great set of hands. Almost cut it off. Friedrich controlled the difficult ball. Had plenty of the ball. Boyd turns a free kick. Looking to kick goal number two. A chance to put a second goal on the board. That's the sort of goal that can get the team up and about. She's excited about that one. It's all level here. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. Richmond have turned the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. Intercepted by McDonald. Puts on a bump. Is in her possession. Goes for territory. Looks like it's going to be paid deliberate. Goes by foot. Webster drops the mark. And the ball bounces across the boundary line. The players will be feeling it out there. Boyd thrashes it. The tackle deserved a free. And gets it. Boyd gets right in her face. A great defensive effort. Uses it now. Looks up with the kick. Kirk looking a bit sluggish out there. Putting on the bump was scary. Moves it by foot. Soccer's a kick. Going for goal number one. Lucky to score with that shot. The kicking seems to be contagious tonight. The margin is one. Ross weighing up the options now. There may only be time for one more chance. She's got the footy in her hands.
can't take possession. She can put it through, takes the chance, and says thank you very much with that goal. Cranston kicks her second. She's enjoying that goal. That's a really good team goal. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Geelong have taken charge of the contested ball. It's allowing them to create their scoring opportunities. Real disappointment for fans of Cork. Richmond, what stood out for you today, Gaz? Sometimes you're just happy to walk away with the four points. They weren't at their best, but they did what they had to do. Final scores are 6 7 43 to 6 0 36. That's it for us. We'll see you again next time. Well, thanks for having me. That's all we have time for. We'll see you next time. Yeah.